Hello, welcome to another Game Boys or Awesome Video Guys. This is going to be a video on how to put ROMs onto the EZ Flash 4 cart. Um, I thought I might as well make one, and someone's actually having some issues as well. So he commented on my new video that I did of, of the review of the item, and that is here. So this is going to be how to put the games onto here without any problems, without the games messing up. Because I've, I've not had this problem since I've been using the way I've been doing it. So there's actually a software you, you use to put them on there. And I think the guy who commented is just putting them on the memory card. And that's, um, don't, they don't work from that way. You need to do it from this software that I'm going to be showing you. Um, the link where I got the software from is not actually working. So what I've done is I've, I've created a sharing, um, I've actually uploaded it to a sharing website. So you can download it from there and you should have the file as well so right what i'm going to do now guys is show you how to do it basically it's pretty simple just follow your steps and you should have it fully working no problems at all if this works for you guys let me know and that would be great so so then i know that it definitely is working for you as well so um let's uh let's um let's do this then guys sorry uh so i've minimized my webcam and now let's um go to where the website is so basically you've got links in the description and the link in the description takes to this website here, which is called jumpshare.com. And what you got to do is download that. And it should come here on the corner and download. And, uh, yeah, so what you've done that, drag it to your desktop, like I've done here. I've got mine here already. Make a file, uh, which is called um, GBA, or whatever. Make a file, whatever you want to call it. I'll just call mine GBA Game Loader. Um, you can call yours whatever you want. So... Drag that into here. A waste that you need as well is Rimwar. So you haven't got Rimwar, that'll be in the link in the description as well, because um, you won't be able to open it without it. It will bring you up, bring you up a little icon like this with like books, and you'll be able to open it. Because before, if you don't have it, you won't be able to open the file up. And it should have these stuff in here. So drag that in there, like that. Right click it, right click, and then press extract. Extract here, and it should bring you these files. Um, delete the delete that file you just put in there. Don't need that anymore. And you should have all these files here, which are what you need. Don't don't move any of these files out, otherwise it will not work. I've, I've tried that and it didn't work properly. So uh, this is what you need. Get your file, get your ROM that you had, extract it, and like this is what you should have out the file out of it. So this is the ROM. That's what was in there. So you've extracted that, and let's go back to this file here. Open up um, EZ4 client and it should bring you here. Minimize that to so bring you to this here. Now, what you've got to do, guys, is press open, find the file that you want to do. I'm going to put Klonoa 2 on there because I haven't got that one on my, on my cartridge yet. And I want to play that game as well, so I'm going to play that after this, get, after this video. So let's click on that. Uh, what you need to do next is actually click here. Click on there and go to go find where your um, first actually sorry find um, where you you got to plug your USB stick in sorry or whatever you, or you got put, put your micro SD card in put that in there plug it in whatever you do you know however your computer can read it I've got mine in a um, card in a SD card reader a micro SD one plug that in. And then you find where it is on your desktop. So, oh, sorry, you click on here. Sorry, you click on there. Find where you where it is. Um, mine's here. And then find or make a file or whatever you want to do, wherever you install to get ROMs. I just made a file on my SD card um, or SD micro SD card. Sorry, um, made a file called GBA. Click on that. And press OK and it should load you up all the ROMs that you've already installed or if you haven't done it yet you won't have any of this. Um, so now once you've um, put the ROM on there, you've, you've already done, um, mine doesn't actually say the correct thing so I'm going to put, um, sometimes it doesn't call it with a name, sometimes it doesn't. So if you want to be able to put the name in, you can, it'll be here. So what you need to do, I'm just going to put the rest of the name in there, Klonoa, uh, oh, some cups. Uh, I can't see it. Clonoa, there we go. And then I put a dash. 
and the number two, I think, it, yeah. Colour number two, and that's how it, how it should be. Um, this is all the right settings. If yours is all set there, so it should be fine. Um, so all you've got to do now is press send. That's sent to the cartridge now. So all you've got to do is press OK. You can, you can close that or put more ROMs in whenever you, whatever you want to do. Um, open up. Uh, basically, that's finished now. You've done, you put the ROM in there. It's selected the saves and everything. Um, so if you've got all that set in what was on there, you'd be fine. So you pull the, pull the, car, pull the um, SD card out. Let me just uh, make my webcam bigger so you can guys and see what I'm doing. Uh, there we go. So you pull the SD card out, put it back in the cartridge. We'll just get it back in there if I can. Back in the cartridge, as you can see there. You can see it. Um, plug it back in your Game Boy. And you should have the um, the games in there if it actually loads. <laughs> it's being weird, sorry. Got a bit of dust in my car in my game. There we go, sorry. There we go. It's working again now. So you can see the focus. Click on that. Click on that. I go down to the, where the cartridges are, or where, the, where I put the game. Sorry. And you should see from number two. Whatever, I think it's there. For some reason I didn't, didn't change the name, but yeah, that's if you do it. I don't think I did it right, but it has put the game on there as you can see. Let's have a look. Oh, it has put it on there. Must have been I tried it before because I was trying it, testing it out. Uh, there we go. Can you see there? Can I can see what I put on there. Loading up. It should have come up with something to do with save. There you go. You saw that. And it's loaded. So that is how you do it, guys. Hope you've um, understood that okay. As you can see, the game is loading. There we go. Can I number two? And that is it, guys. Let me just uh, show you. And the game is working. So... That is how you do it, guys. Hope you understand that, understood that okay. Any more problems, leave a comment in the section. I can try and help you out. Um, hope this has helped you out, as I said, and um, sorted out the problem. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and hope this has helped you. So thanks a lot, guys. Bye.